Attorney General Tommy Thomas himself will lead the prosecution team against former Prime Minister Datuk Sri Najib Tun Razak, Bernama reported. Quoting a source, the national news agency said Najib is expected to face more than 10 counts of committing criminal breach of trust linked to the SRC International Sindirian Berhad case. The source has confirmed that Najib would be charged on Wednesday at the Kuala Lumpur court. Another source told Bernama that Najib would be charged at Criminal Sessions Court 2 located at Level 4 on the right wing of the Kuala Lumpur Courts Complex. The case will be mentioned before the Sessions Court and then it will be transferred to the Criminal High Court 1. Najib was arrested at his residence in Jalan Langgak Duta here on July 3rd over the investigation into SRC International. He had gone to MACC headquarters twice earlier to have his statement recorded over the investigation into a case related to SRC International. SRC International was a subsidiary of One Malaysia Development Berhad and was placed under the jurisdiction of the Finance Ministry in 2012. MACC Chief Commissioner Datuk Sri Muhammad Shukri Abdul said on May 22nd that its probe in 2015 against Najib involved funds of 2.6 billion ringgit and 42 million ringgit that were believed to have been transferred from SRC International to the former Prime Minister's personal bank accounts.